I'm just joking. Welcome to my mom cave. I'm going to give you a updated tour because we have not done this in quite some time. So I hope you enjoy this video. If you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button so you can stay up to date with my videos. So I'm going to start on this side and then I'm going to work my way around that way. So this little area I have, I had did a video about the Michael Simply Tidy system and this is one of the um, module system that they have in it and I just kept the ones for the paper storage because paper storage is so difficult to find like really good storage and these are good for like my 12 by 12 paper. I like using cardstock for various reasons. My kids use them for projects. My daughter loves them. and. This section is kind of still in the works because I have just some like miscellaneous items here and what I'm actually I'm going to get a thin desk so I can like create an L shape in this area and then have like more desk space. That's my plans and possibly maybe put that underneath it. I'm not sure. But I have this um, rack. I purchased it from Home Goods. It was actually on clearance and I think I got it for like eight bucks because it had like a damage to the top. I keep magazines here and these are two new notebooks that I got that I want to keep close by. So they're just there for now. So here is like my new section that I added. It's kind of like my plant section. I have this, um, these, all these plants are new. And I wanted to bring some green into the office. So I'm starting out with these as my first couple plants inside of my office. This is definitely growing. And I'm, I can't pick it up because I just watered it. And I don't want the water to spill. But um, this pegboard is from Michael's. I think they still have it. I'm not sure. I was lucky enough to get one that was in the clearance bin. That was not really clearance. But I got it for like... Um, I think 15 bucks it's like $40 so my vision for this board is to just have lots of like nice pictures that match the aesthetic of the room or maybe just like cards I'm not sure yet so this is the desk area this is where I am most of the time throughout the day I have this little caddy basket caddy that I'm planning to keep like my planner in once I set up my planner for 2021 these are just some of the planners that I have. Well, actually, this is just one planner. And these are some of the Simply Gilded sticker storage system. The, the, stickers, um, the sticker albums. And I have my desk agenda here. These are just some new items that I received in the mail from Right For My Heart Design. She's on Instagram. The desk has a storage system from the container store. I do have a video in depth about these. You can mix and match and create um, the kind of system that works for you. Um, check that out if you have some time. In the drawers, I keep one drawer, I have my sticker storage system. And then the other drawer, I keep like miscellaneous items. Um, not too junky, but I try to keep these as um, light as possible and to take out anything that I'm not using. So over there, um, this it's like a file um, drawer system from Ikea. It's the Alex drawer and this holds my makeup. Um, and then I have like paperwork in the other drawers. These knobs are from Home Goods. You can pick up any knobs and add them yourself to kind of give it a, um, a better look. My desk is from Wayfair. I'm not sure if they have it, but if you go to Wayfair, you can Google, you can search gold and yellow desk and you can see tons of variations of this one because this one is not available. Um, I have this little footstool here that I keep to rest my foot on when I'm like in meetings or if I just need to put my foot up while I'm at work. So what I did over here, I added my um, pencil tree that I got from Michael's. Um, I do have a link for this tree and these ornaments are also from Michael's including the bows and it just fit perfectly into this little section right here. Um, some gifts that I bought for myself. It is my birthday month so I definitely want to treat myself a little bit. I have my closet system here from Ikea. This is the Ikea Pax wardrobe system. It's customizable and you can 
kind of customize it to the space that you have. So I have the deepest one. I, I'm not sure the depth, but there is one that's like 20 something um, depth. I think this is 40 something. I could have gone with the other one, but I just chose this one because I didn't know at the time. But it suits every, my needs. I'm able to fit some of my clothes here, like my newer clothes, the ones that I really like, the cutesy stuff. And then I have some books up top with my pocketbooks, um, sweaters, that little rose gold container contains all of my scarves, um, head tie, not scarves, my hats, and my um, headbands, the cloth headbands, like the little beads on them. And then up top here, I have more decorative boxes. These are all from Marshalls and Home Goods. You can always pick these up for like um, less than $20 for even three of them. I have more um, bags here and my nail polish. That box contains lots of nail polish, all the nail things. And then these, I'm not sure what's in them. I think they're like older inserts. I try to keep my um, older inserts for a couple years. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them after a while. But um, that's just where they are for now. Alright, so... I can link this system in the description, but it's called the PAX wardrobe system and you basically mix and match and you can customize the um, how many shelves you want. You can make it um, a full hanger. It's really for a closet, but I thought that it was very cute and I like how I can like design it on my own and make it um, specific just for my needs. So being that I do get dressed in this room as well. I do have some of my toiletry items over here. I'm going to show you in a minute. I have some of my accessories here that contains my glasses, earrings, a couple of my card holders are here, um, some jewelry, watches, and belts. And then in these drawers, I have um, t-shirts that I wear when I'm going out. These are either new or already worn. I keep my pajamas in here. And then the bottom drawer has my underwear. So if you come over onto this side, I have this little system set up as kind of like um, a, little, a vanity. I added this mirror that I purchased from a thrift store for like five bucks. Came out really cute in this area and I added these flowers from Michaels. So these are some Christmas decor that I have. Not much de Christmas decor here, but um, except for the tree, these two Christmas um decorative items and then I think I have something else somewhere here but this little section contains like my perfume my lotion and my deodorant lotion especially now that it's winter time and my skin gets really dry so I keep my lotions here I keep the most recent bag that I wear out on this um it's actually a cake stand but I like it um it's been in here for a long time and I'm not going to take it out so I wore this bag last, so I keep it here just so if I'm looking for items, I can just know which bag I had the last time so I'm not like looking all over the place. So that's the reason why that's the hair. This little pull-out tray is where I do all my planner setups. I have my paper cutter here so I can easily cut and trim my inserts. I have a um, hole puncher. I have my, um, I use this to make the edges round. And then I have like dashboards and a whole bunch of miscellaneous papers. I'm in the process of setting up the 2021 planner. So that is kind of like really full right now. Um, in this drawer, I have, let me just make sure there's no, good. So in this drawer, I have some, I have my mail bin. This mail bin, I've been asked about it so many times. And it's basically from... I think it's from Hobby Lobby. I bought it a couple years ago. I'm not sure if you can find it, but I spray painted the edges pink because it was brown and I thought that it just made it look a little bit better. So here I have, I think notebooks. Okay. So in this box, I have my pouches here. And in this box, I have um, some things for my daughter. I keep my label maker here along with my little pouch thingy for my sprocket and just some extra Louis Vuitton bags that I had. In this drawer, I have my extra inserts. My stamps are in here. 
and these are like extra makeup items that's not in the other drawer my older planners are there and these are just some miscellaneous junk items that i had in a drawer i just put it there this little bag contains all of the disc i have so many different colored disc um different sizes that's what's in that one this one was my planner junk drawer it's kind of um i kind of straighten it up a little bit so it doesn't look too bad i know where everything is i have like my little um <laughs> hammers my screwdriver little things if i want to add anything to the wall i know i'm not supposed to use, use a hammer but i just pretty lazy like that uh, my paper cutters and then i have um random miscellaneous stuff hot glue gun a whole bunch of glue stick because my daughter is forever gluing something so that's what that is and then in the bottom drawer i have shipping information not shipping information um packaging for my orders and stuff like that so this is the pack system i have a space for everything i know where everything is pretty simple to find um one thing with keeping this room pretty organized is like i said everything having its own space so if we go around to this side, this wall, these wall decals are from Rocky Mountain wall decals and they're still on the website. I can link these if you're interested. Um, very easy to install. Um, it just added a really good touch to the room. I really love it. Um, these drapes are from Home Goods. They're very thick and it has that nice texture that I have. Um, I still have the same futon, but now I kind of open it out if I ever take a break at work. I usually like to just take a quick nap if I have the time. If not, um, like directly after work, sometimes I'm just mentally drained. I just come and I take a quick little nap or relax here and watch TV for a little bit before I start like my schoolwork or attend to like any type of family, um, such as getting the kids, checking over the kids' schoolwork. My daughter mostly, she needs help. Um, we have Snoopy here, whose little bed is right here. He uses it as a little leverage to jump on the bed. This is where he hangs out. My shelves are from Ikea. I just have, you know, various decorative items on it, including my books from the Obamas, um, Barack and Michelle. Those flowers are from my um, Amazon. I just added them in a vase and then this random books. So also Ikea, I think this is called the LAC, L-A-K or L-A-C-K. And these are just things that I may use or may not use. Like the phone, it is, um, it is a real phone, but I just don't have it connected. Like who has a landline nowadays? I don't know. Um, I bought this lotion from a girl called Regular Girl Cosmetics. Not bought, she sent it to me and it smells really good. So I keep it here. For after washing my hands when i come back in this room i just come here really quick get some lotion and um, moisturize my hands i have this here for um pillow mist sometimes when i'm in here like all day and i want the room to kind of smell good i take this um love rose and vanilla from bath and body works and just spray on the pillows or just spray um in the air and then these are some like planner trinkets my remote control because when I lay here the TV is over there I just um, use it to control the TV so this side is a closet filled with so many different things I have storage boxes to keep everything organized I know what's in all of the boxes this way they're not they're not scattered and that's kind of one thing I like about having storage boxes even if you have a lot of items in a room if you add them in decorative boxes it helps to make it look a little bit more neater so like this box has ribbons and things like that the other one have flowers um like fancy little papers and stuff like that i know what's in it i have extra printer paper up top that box has all of the little drawings and stuff my daughter makes for me i keep them in a box because she's always making something I have um, my Cricut here. This doesn't belong here. This was just here because my daughter was shipping out her scrunchies. So I have my Cricut machine here. When I'm ready to use it, I will pull it forward and just um, connect the mat to it. I have one printer here. I use the HP Envy. And then on top of that, I have my printer papers. 
I have a separate printer here. This is the HP Envy as well. No, this is HP something, I'm not sure. But I have two printers here. Um, these are a part of the Michaels Simply Tidy Cube system. I just separated them and add them here so I can have that shelf to get extra storage. So this wire basket contains things that I need for my 2021 setup, stuff that I have that I have been buying from lots of different shops. I just have them all there. They're, everything in there is new. Haven't gotten a chance to really go through it yet, but that's what that is. And then on here, I have uh, my cutter, my paper mats and my vinyl for my Cricut machine. And then I have like yarns and things like that in the bottom and just miscellaneous items. So we're almost around in a full circle. This little rack is from Target. I just used some of those binder clips and I added all of my face mask. Once they're dirty, I do wash them and then I hang dry them. Sometimes if they're really wrinkled, I may like, to, I may um, iron them out a little bit before I put them on. I know that sounds crazy, but I iron them sometimes. Um, this is a press for stickers DIY thingy that I made one time. And um, just quickly, I forgot to show you something on this side. So if, if uh, I'm definitely going to post this during the holidays. So if you're in Target, go and get these. This is not sponsored, but these are so good. So I keep them here as a treat for when I need. So these are my pop collection. Just people that I like, movie stars. I started to collect from The Walking Dead and then I wanted to get the characters from Black Panther. And then I, my newest one is Miranda from The Office. The Office is my favorite movie. Not The Office, I'm sorry. Miranda from, um, I can't think today. Miranda from The Devil Wears Prada. Um, you can see I still have the DVD. I'm not throwing it out, even though I don't have anything to play it on, but that's my pop collection so oh that was a lot i didn't even think that it would take this long to talk about what's here but this is my updated office and i hope you like it if you have any questions about anything that you see please comment below if you're new hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to date um thank you for watching and have a good day